With Formosa Chemicals fighting against Zhanghua authorities to keep its plant in the county open, Wang Wenyuan, the president of Formosa Chemicals' parent company, finally broke his long-running silence over the standoff. Wang stated that three years ago he had reached an agreement with the county to slowly scale down operations until all the employees had retired. But the county's recent moves to shut down the plant has now set off protests by some of the thousand workers. Employees at a plant operated by the Formosa Chemicals and Fiber Corporation continued their sit-in protests in front of the Zhanghua County government offices. The protest prompted some surprising comments from Formosa Plastic Group President Wang Wenyuan, who let it slip that in 2013 he had achieved an understanding with the Zhanghua County government that would gradually scale back the facility. He was hoping to get support from the new county government to continue operations until the plant's roughly 1,000 employees could retire. We're gradually drawing down operations at our Zhanghua plant to accommodate our workers there, who are on average about 40 or 50 years old, as they slowly leave the plant. Final plan is still to slowly phase out operations at the Zhanghua plant. If the Formosa Chemicals and Fiber Corporation intends to continue its operations there and is willing to take care of the rights of its employees, the company should legally submit an application to resume operation of its three boilers that were shut down. The EPA would review it in line with regulations. Confronted by FPG President Wang Wenyuan's public appeal in front of the local media, the Zhanghua County government remained seemingly unmoved. But the two prerogatives of protecting workers' rights and the environment are opposed in this particular case, posing a tough challenge for the two sides.